Oh, good, a fairy. Which means I'm facing the boss, who I forget... Oh, God, who was this boss again? Uh, save state, for lack of preparation. Oh, this guy, right. The sword and shield guy, who I personally think should have belonged in the, uh... Sword and shield dungeon. Yeah. Oh, that was me being stupid again. Would a Pegasus Seed help? Uh, I don't have Pegasus Seeds. It's, I think they're gonna hold off the Pegasus Seeds until the end of the game. Oh. And just kill this oh. guy. Well, he went down tremendously easier than the last time. And I got a checkpoint, just in case I screw up again. Hooray. Alright. So now let's start going to get the treasure of this area. Because it's gonna be awesome to get. Come on, stupid bat. Ha! Gotcha! Alright. Drop a bomb here. Run away, like a little girl. Let's go in here. Okay, so this is one of the major puzzles of the area. Um, I hate this. Yeah. Now, it's not that bad, I just need to remember how I do it. It's more important uh, to make sure the bats do not knock you around, because... The thing is, if the bats knock you around, they will, uh, kind of screw up what you're doing. Fail, 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 fail. Who the hell hey, is Rolk. yelling fail? Damn it, Rolk. Rolk. Huh? Damn it, fail, Rolk, fail, are you working fail, with fail, me or against fail, me fail, here? Fail, 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 Come on, you can fail. No, I've been through this. Yeah, I know what to fail. do now. You can do it. Dun, 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 dun. Alright, so now I got the switch hook. This is kind of an interesting item, actually. It's, I would dare say it's as interesting as the magnetic gloves from Season, because you can use this on an object, and you will switch places with it. Like that. Honestly, that's kind of a neat item. I like it. I, yeah, I like it. approve. Alright. So now it's we need to work... <laughs> What? Hmm? I'm sorry, what? Huh? What? And you can also use this to damage enemies that. from afar. Or... Okay, that was weird. Normally it just damages enemies, but it actually switches pla- You can switch places with enemies too, that's... Yeah. Okay, that's nice to know. Yeah, it's only the weak enemies, like a gel or something. Oh. Well, that is incredibly Dude, interesting. I did not know that. Or... Distance attack. Seems like you got a little mad. Ah, fuck. That didn't work out at all. Okay. Go this way now. Okay. Now, this is an interesting puzzle because you gotta make sure you swap the... A triangle onto the block. Otherwise, you get stuck, and somehow you have to redo the level. But now we're on the upper levels of the dungeon, which is good because the lower levels suck. Look at all the nostalgia from the lower levels and all the puzzles we had to go through <laughs> in this hellhole. And stairs. Stairs are good. Guidos oh, are not. Underneath. Wait, what was over here on the side here? Oh, uh, just another wall. Something. I don't know. Kill the snakes. Kill the snakes. Okay, we need to leave that pot where it is. Because first we need to switch this off the middle platform, and then use the pot in order to get back over here. Now, for this puzzle to work, you gotta 
kind of uh, work your, your yourself and the thing over here. Get it over there, swap out with it, and that way you don't get stuck. And let's kill this thing. Alright, now, here's the point where I thought I got incredibly stuck. Well, not quite here, but this is where... Th this is kind of a point of no return. Because you, as you notice, there are... Well, there are no longer any enemies. There are no pots, so once you start swapping yourself around like this, there is no going back. And you will see why I thought I was stuck soon enough. Okay, this room. Oh, it didn't change. Hey, you missed it. Thank you. Oh, I, I went over it and everything. Alright. Change it back to blue, because I like blue. More P-Hats. Destroy the P-Hats. Destroy the non-believers. Oh god. Oh god, oh god, no, stop chasing me, you bastard! Ha. Okay, now we come to this hellhole of a puzzle. Okay, I'm just not gonna really focus- I'm gonna first kill- Ah. Uh, clear out the enemies. I'm gonna clear out the enemies first, cause this requires all my concentration to get working. So, fuck the puzzle for now, let's just exit here, and go back in. So... I gotta go this way first. And I gotta make sure I get this center tile. And once I get that, I am good for pretty much the rest of this puzzle. As long as I do not screw up. One of the problems is because Link does not lock onto a tile, um, it's actually pretty easy to accidentally misstep and screw yourself out of uh, solving the puzzle. Yeah, I remember this took you a while. <laughs> Yeah, but now I got it solved. Wata! And we get a small key. Which allows us to walk up here. Well, not quite here, but... Alright, now here's the point where I thought I got stuck. Because this is the room... It Well, I never actually checked the map in this dungeon, but... This is right before the boss. So, you're probably thinking, well wait, are we already at the boss? Where's the boss key, though? It, we didn't miss something, did we? Well, for a long time, for a while, I thought I did as well. Even back there, most of the dungeon, looking for it. <laughs> well, not most of the dungeon. It's what? Not most of the dungeon. It's more like, yeah, I didn't notice the set of stairs here. That's basically what it was. So now let's go up here and actually take a look around. And there's jumping puzzles. Oh god. And oh god, I just realized. Can these things crush me? You know what? Not I need to check really. this. Let me Think save so. state. Save state. And let's see if I can actually get crushed. I can get crushed, but it does not kill me because it's not a death trap. It's not intended to be a death trap, I should say. It's also not intended for me to just jump onto. But yay, 2D pots. And a small jump. And I'm out of here. And this is what we needed the key for. Now I need to switch hook in order to get over to the... To get to the lava, that's great. Run! Okay, we're over here now. Now, this is kind of a bastard part of the area right here. And you will see <laughs> why. Just That's wait for it. Small. You'll see how bad it gets in a second here. 
Run, Link, run! Oh god, fuck. I should've jumped. Yes, you should've. So yeah, you got like, barely enough time to clear this room. You gotta like, pull the lever out as far as you can, and you have to get running the moment you stop. And don't slow down. Ha! Made it. Okay. Ah, fuck. Now I don't have my sword on, I'm completely exposed. That's great. But these stupid enemies. Okay. From this point on, I just need this. I don't need the lava flow or anything. I can just use my switch hook for the rest of this room. <coughs> no problems here at all. Okay, I do have to use the feather at this one tile. Dun dun dun. Yay. <laughs> and we have a small puzzle here. This is actually this is actually quite of a good puzzle, I will admit. Because note that this room has nothing but jars, so you need to be kinda careful with how you do things, otherwise you get stuck. For example, if you do not push this jar down here, uh, you're gonna regret it later, and you'll see exactly why. Push that there, and let's just go ahead and go through the rest of this area. So jump here, and this is why you wanted to push the jar over, so you can get back, and get the boss key. Otherwise you get terribly stuck and it's not fun for anyone, especially me. Run! Okay. Will I have enough time? Oh wait, yeah, I have to use uh, this again. I might actually have enough time for the boss. Should I try it? Do you remember how to beat it? Uh, let me think. <clears throat> Off the top of my head, no, but I don't think it was that hard. You know what? I'm not gonna risk it. I'll save the boss for next time on Let's Play Legend Zelda Oracle of Ages. So, see you guys later. Say bye, guys. Bye-bye. Yeah. <laughs>